Stress is a well-documented factor in such life-shortening disorders as heart disease, diabetes, and obesity. It can contribute to headaches, depression, asthma, and gastrointestinal problems, and may even be linked to Alzheimer's disease. And while we're aware of many causes of stress, there's one we often don't consider. Stress, it seems, can be inherited. A recent study from the University of Pennsylvania that used 52 years of data on the snowshoe hare points to stress as a major factor in the wildly varying numbers from generation to generation. Snowshoe hares are evidently good eats. When hare populations are up, the study shows, predators gather quickly to enjoy a great big bunny banquet, subsequently stressing the pellets out of the surviving few. Freaked out hare females with high levels of stress hormones give birth to smaller litters with smaller babies who also possess high stress hormone levels, and subsequent generations then decline in numbers. The researchers noticed that the sharper the loss of the heavily populated generation, the longer the number slump persisted through following generations. And this has more to do with than just bugs in family. Human stress is not only caused by the everyday pressures of our personal lives, but far greater factors like pollution, war, and natural disasters. A field called epigenetics is the study of factors other than DNA that affect the development of an organism. And previous research suggests humans can bear genetic scars from high-stress events faced by their ancestors. So, the snowshoe hare's ordeals and their effects on future generations may not be so far from our own.